Okay guys, so now let's change the SSID name and password. So you need to log in on their default gateway. Type in your default gateway from achieving from the command prompt you type ipconfig then the first the default gateway you type it in your browser that's it then in to this is the gateway the modem gateway then you click login on the upper right there's a login then username and password are found on bottom of the device so you type user then type typing the correct password and you press login so it means that this is already the advanced configuration mode on your HG18 180 so this is a VDSL2 modem from fiber home so if you're gonna set up we're gonna go to the basic setup the wire one service below this is the LAN this is the one the wireless local access network so that's what we're looking for so here is a basic configuration on a 2.4 uh, basic configuration on a 5 gigahertz so they are both separate since they are they different frequency if you wanna change this is the SSID so if you this you need to change this test Wi-Fi on your preference then check the enable one wireless LAN and enable SSID then uncheck this enable isolation hide SSID if you want to hide the SSID this, there's an available feature for that you just need to check then for the country you need to properly con select your Philippines okay so that's the 2.4 and for the 5 gigahertz it means unchecked that that means that the 5 gigahertz on my modem is not enabled and also unchecked so SSID is for the 5 gigahertz SSID because this is under the 5 gigahertz then you choose the Philippines okay then that's how you change the SSID that SSID means the the, the name of your Wi-Fi here uh, that's test Wi-Fi yes that's test Wi-Fi then yep so aside from that you can also modify the password here password SSID one authentication type there's a lot you select select the WPA2 dash PSK mixed then the WPA pre-share key where you type your password so you can have a separate password for your 2.4 and a 5 gigahertz so same you need to input your pa your desired password in the WPA pre-share key so that's how you change the SSID name of your Wi-Fi and the password of your Wi-Fi for both 2.4 and 5 gigahertz. Okay. So any questions and recommendations are highly appreciated on the comment section. If you learn something from this video, then you may share it with your friends for the change of the Wi-Fi name and password okay so that's it and additional since you stayed long for that video there's an advanced setup you click the one so advanced configuration so in the advanced configuration you can see the mode of the wireless it's also has a 2.4 and a 5 gigahertz mode so for this a mode means device so B G N so it depends on the technology but your latest device to enable the wide flexibility you can enable all it all then for the bandwidth 
you ha you can choose this a uh, mixture of 2.20 20 and 40 by the way this channel is the one that are available for the 2.4 so there's a 11 channels so 1 to 11 so this channel 3 has no interference with my neighborhood that's why I choose channel 3 so that's it that's how you change a channel for a 2.4 so this is a 2.4 let's go to 2.4 to the 5 gigahertz so same there's a channel section you can change it by default it's already on auto so every time you turn on your device it will scan and input the channel with the least interference so it's also an import important to manually input your channel to prevent interference with your neighborhood so that's it so okay so that's how you change your ssid name the password and the channel configuration for your wi-fi so anything please comment down section below and you might like and share this video for your home needs so thank you and bye okay like and share my profile the elmer shocks learning every day Thanks.